Hello there guys, it's Tony here. Uh, just do a little bit of Battlefield 3 gameplay and a post commentary. I, this is not live. I'm actually just doing this in Sony Vegas right now, so if I don't like if you think I'm a good multitasker and I can talk and like talk about other stuff while playing, please don't think that I am I a terrible multitasker. But anyway, moving on. Um a few topics I want to talk about tonight. First of them being DayZ. Um I actually did start uh, start recording an episode. Um I think it was Wednesday night, Wednesday morning, I don't know. It was on a Wednesday, I'm pretty sure. But basically what happened was, so it was, it was great at first. I'm going to do a long story short. I got killed, um, not surprising, but in I was in Chernog, uh, Chernosk, or Cherno, I don't know. Chernosk, the full Russian way. But, um, so what happened was, like again, long story short, I was I spawned in, went in Cherno, found a car, drove the car up to the hospital, and I found a fully functioning helicopter, and I was flipping out. Except the thing was, it didn't have any fuel, and I did partner up with this strange guy that I did not know. He was he didn't look too hostile. He was at the hospital at the time where I did find the helicopter, so I was like, you know what, I better take the friendly way and keep him with me. Plus, for some reason, my crowbar wasn't working, so I couldn't kill him. So I was a little bit worried. And it's always a little bit better to have some company in a zombie apocalypse than not have any at all. Unless you're a bandit, then you just want to be alone, I'm pretty sure. Most of the time, unless you're like a group of bandits. Fucking hellers. Ruining the game for everyone. God. So, um... Yeah, I spent maybe half an hour. I have the clip of it, footage of it. Um, I, I don't know. I don't know if I want to decide to show it or not, but I will probably. Uh, what happened was, um, after f refueling it halfway, we f uh, he decided he wanted to fly to the gas station west of Cherno, and he lands there, and we, you know, re we get a few refuels in, but then I die because I. I don't know if I get shot by him or some other guy. I'm not sure, but I end up dying, and I'm like, shit. Well, that was gay. Um, but, like, I can't tell if it was him or not. I heard the chopper gun go off, the M240, I think it was. Um, I heard it go off, but couldn't tell if it was him or another, or he was shooting another person. I'm not even sure, but whatever. Um, the That public private hive was just like no uh, it's it was like a private hive that you can join in publicly you don't have to pay or apply or anything so i didn't and second of all it was a non-rp like private hive so you, you you like could kill on site and that for me is just a little bit of a disappointment because you know Unless you're a big douchebag who wants to go around killing people who, like, try to work hard for what they have. Um, I would recommend you should play on, a, like, a Private Hive Daisy RP server. That actually you have to, like, do a little bit of RP before you can kill the guy. Like, if, you, um, one example is, like, you're allowed to kill people still. You just, you can't kill them on site without them even knowing who you are. Like, if you want to take their stuff, you have to hold them, hold them up or something. That's what I've heard. And so... I'm looking to try at one of those servers, I guess, but, you know, it's, it's the thing about Daisy, you want to start very friendly, you don't want to go all hostile on everyone, that just ruins the game, because, you know, you, you would rage if you work so hard for everything, I know I would, you would, you work so hard for everything you got, and then you get killed by someone who's just a big douchebag, that's, what, yeah, exactly, so, yeah, that's, Moving on now, I guess. Um, other news, my computer upgrade. I am probably going to upgrade my, um, I guess, storage, you could call. Uh, at the moment, I'm currently recording with Fraps. And so, unfortunately, that guy was a ninja. He flew past me. But uh, what happened? Um, 
I tried using DX Tori, except the thing was that my write speeds are not quick enough because I'm currently using a, you know, old fashioned hard disk drive. And unfortunately, with Windows running off of that, while my game is running off of that and everything else, it's not fast enough to record with DX Tori. So um, I am going to get an SSD and solid state drive disk, if you guys don't know what that is. Oh, no, no, solid state drive, yeah. Shit, there's no, there's not an SSD, it's just SSD, what am I thinking? Sorry, there's no disk, it's a, it's all flash memory, what am I thinking? Okay, but anyway, um, moving on, um, I don't know what manufacturer I should get, I've heard that OCC is currently having some issues with their, um, budget, I guess, uh, they're going down on the stock market, but, the reason why I still wouldn't go with them is probably because they do offer a five-year warranty with their product. And what are you going to do if your um, SSD breaks and their company has gone down the hole? So they're not going to have anything to replace it. So I would go with something else. Um, I'm probably looking forward towards an, a Crucial M4 or a Kingston HyperX or a Samsung 840. 840 series or something i'm not sure but i will be checking it out um and for another thing you guys might uh, um i'm not sure if it's just me or the actual video but i can hear a lot of background noise and it's because of my fans for my corsair h80 cooling my cpu and unfortunately the fans and those things are absolutely terrible um they're just so loud, so it kind of sucks. And with a lot of background notes from your fan, it's just like, oh my god. So I will be upgrading those as well. I'm looking for a, I'm looking probably for a Corsair Static Pressure Quiet Edition fan. So I might be getting one of those or not. I'm not sure. But oh, quick reminder about the. SSD. Um, if you guys have any suggestions for a manufacturer that I should go with, please do suggest one in the comments. I would love to check out a like. Just give me a favorable one that you guys want to go for. I guess I don't know. <laughs> but um, let's see. What else do I have to talk about tonight? Uh, I'm not sure to be honest. Daisy computer upgrading. Hmm. Nothing really, I guess. I guess nothing. Oh, but one quick story about a not a story, but like a little quick note. Um, I'm sure if you guys have been over YouTube a lot as much as I am, you have probably um seen the YouTube user Frankie on PC in 1080p. Oh my god, you guys have to watch him if you guys haven't seen his Daisy series or any of his videos in general. Like they're absolutely amazing. I I don't know how to describe it. It's just either because like he has a British accent and having a British accent makes your videos like amazing. Unless you're one of those like hardcore non understandable accents. But then if if you can just like his accents are is so cool. I'm not gonna lie. It's awesome. And he's just a really funny guy. So if you also haven't seen his Daisy series, it is absolutely amazing. I would rate it ten out of ten, maybe even like a million out of ten. I don't know. Yeah. A little bit cheesy, but it is probably the greatest, if not the greatest, um, the, uh, Daisy series I've ever seen out there. It is so interesting, and he is the luckiest player I've ever seen on Daisy. Like how he finds stuff, how he knows the entire map. Like he knows what to do. His strategies. It's just like if you want a lot of strategy strategies and like tips and like get better at Daisy, just watch his videos and like apply that to your own mind. And I, I can guarantee you, you'll get a little better, if not, a, like, amazingly better. So, that's all I had to say. I will link his channel down below my description, and for you guys to see. Uh, 
but trust me, go watch him. He's quite amazing. One day, I hope I can join him in Daisy and play multi kill. Oh yeah! But like I said, yeah, I that's all I plan on saying. But mm, I don't know if I had anything else to say. Mm. Oh, quick note to you guys out there in the East Coast. Good luck to you. Um, best prayers. I mean, I don't know if I'm a little late if the storm's over or not, but Hurricane Sandy, um, please, good luck to you. The best of luck. I re really feel there for you. Um, I know that New York hasn't been hit this hard since, like, 1934, I think, a hurricane that hard, but... Good luck. Best of luck. You're in my prayers. I don't even really pray though, but I feel it is a very respectful thing to say. So. And, oh, also guys, if you guys are, like, if you guys hear, like, a, like, a, th every time I make an S noise or a, th like, a TH, that's because I, th I'm pretty sure I have a lips, lips, th yeah, something like that, and so I'm like I'm apologizing here, but that is how I was born. I don't know how to change it unless I go get some like professional speaking lessons, which I don't plan on doing because I don't think it's very necessary. Makes me unique. Yeah, you see right there, I have like speaking problems. Unique. There we go. Unique. Maybe because it's, I'm like maybe because it's like I'm Asian or something, not a good English speaker. Being in Asian has its pros and cons. Don't know about, it. but yeah, I guess that's it. Um, all right. Um, other updates, real quick. Uh. Let's see, Minecraft server, no idea what I'm doing on that right now. I focus more on my own computer real quick. Uh, I've been like more focused into my computer more than the actual server of the like the dedicated server. So whether I save up money for the dedicated server or my personal computer, I will probably lean towards my personal computer. Um, I will. I'm kind of hesitant to have that vanilla server just because if I did want to create a vanilla Minecraft series, I don't know if I would have the time for it. So right now I'm just sticking to DayZ and a little bit of Battlefield 3. Probably more Battlefield 3 than I would ever like think I would ever have. But so yeah, the server uh updates for it like that I would say not happening for a while now so sorry for that whole like got so excited and then oh no it's not happening now but I just rather have my own stuff personally upgrade it first and then move on to that but uh let's see I guess that's all I had to say yeah that should be the last of it all right, thank you guys. Um, P.S. This is my first time using Sony Vegas to render a video, and trust me, I've kind of worked as hard as I can on it. Um, being a beginner, I have no idea how to use most of the functions, so I have only learned the basics, like how to record your voice live from Vegas and how to like cut videos and like tr make transitions and those are all the basic stuff so but I don't think I'll need anything else more than that right now at least um I'll have to learn like after effects and stuff but that's all I I guess um all right thanks guys give me a like like this video subscribe and share this page thank you again and this is Tony signing out